hello hello everyone it's me jessica and welcome back to my channel um today we are going to dive into some eco lifestyle rags to riches um but we are going to look at some changes and if you watch the speed build assuming that i i should be posting that first um then you already know a little bit that we moved them to a different lot like i've been wanting to but it's just in the same neighborhood i got rid of the old mill house um sorry Beth sterling um i moved her over by the quarry so she's no longer our neighbor um but anyways we're gonna go ahead and look at those changes and dive into some gameplay i was going to do some off camera play to kind of try and get ahead in their storyline a little bit for you guys um but it is honestly it's hallie's birthday and um so i just kind of took that opportunity to give them a new home essentially um it's like the same home but just better and um it's her birthday so that's what we're gonna do today and then after this part i will probably do that little bit of gameplay off camera like i talked about to do a, a bit of a time hop um so we might even age cohen up in the next part to a teenager um but for now let's just <laughs> reel in the reins jessica let's do this part let's do this all right guys we are gonna go ahead and start this tour um real quick if you've already seen the tour i'm gonna try and keep this more simple um i'm gonna kind of back out actually real quick to look at the exterior um so what we have is like a whole lot of trees whole lot of trees um looking pretty good though i kept the um words the skylight in their room and then that's the only skylight and i'll kind of show you the backyard real quick as well we still have our sales table right here in the front um a little sun on the wall um one of my favorite honestly favorite decorations in the game because i like to have those in real life um so here is the backyard and it's quite busy i took a really good amount of time to do a tour of this in the actual speed build um, and you'll see it, of course, as we're playing, but there's just a little activity space kind of, you know, for fitness of all ages, I guess you could say. Um, the underneath part, of course, for eating and for the logic skill and stuff, we have a little area for our crops right over here. Um, and this space is actually more of like a skill building. There's juicing, the woodworking and stuff like that. Um, we have a bunch of our eco kind of lifestyle stuff over here or grubs and all that good stuff in this direction. There is a gate off on uh, this side of the, the house. Um, and then there's a tiny little pool. I'm sure you already caught that. Um, but it's just kind of like right here in the center and I love the way it lights up the backyard area. Um, I think it looks really nice. Um, a little yoga mat, of course, right in front of the pool. I kind of thought that that was a cute touch. Um, and then this just whole trellis thing. Like, um, I, I like the actual trellis over the top. That's one of my favorite things to do in The Sims. Um, I got that, I think, originally from James. Is like one of the first people I saw do that. Um, but I've seen so many people do it since then. It makes so much, like, sense. Um, but then the, like the side trellis I, I got that from watching Abilene's uh speed builds here recently um I've been trying to like just make the rounds with all of my my simmers you know I like seeing everyone's styles and stuff um but I guess let's go ahead and just press play and dive into it right now we actually mess, have uh, Cohen uh, what? is my tv muted <clears throat> Now it is. <laughs> okay, so we have Cohen sitting here hanging out with Cecilia. They're actually doing a good job of getting to know each other, which I think is nice. Um, but she is feeling flirty, so that's kind of weird. Um, it, it's cool, though. You're my sister. Surely you know better than to be weird. <laughs> um, oh, I guess I could do a bit of a better job showing you guys the inside here. Like I said, if you watch the speed build, you've already seen this. Um, but when you come inside, the I, first off, I love the whole front of this house now. I think that it looks so nice. Just so nice. Love it, love it. Um, oh, he's sleeping on the couch, but everyone is asleep right now. 
and he's awake. Okay, so when you come in, the kitchen is off over to the right here. That is a, a little bathroom right there. I guess, you know, you probably could have guessed that. There's a little eating space, but there is also um, the, the bar top itself. So I didn't really care too much that it was um, just a three-seater table. I'm sorry, if you hear my daughter, she's supposed to be taking a nap, but you know, we know how these things go. Um, little, I wanted the fireplace on an angle again, but it just made more sense to have the computer right here because I wanted for their house to still be very much a tiny space um, but I will show you guys real quick this is just the little bathroom in here I kept it very dark um, I like the aesthetics just very dark in this house um, that's how they were in the last house and so that's how they are now um, and I explained this in the speed build once again um, but these flooring actually the floor that I used um, it has an eco footprint that is better than like the flooring that came with eco lifestyle doesn't have an eco footprint which is weird to me I do not like that um, but it's it's fine so you come in here you got a little baby Yoda watching over you some cute pictures on the wall and succulents and stuff they've got a closet just you know living life over here um, and then in this corner is where the fabricator is I just kind of shoved it in the corner with the lamp and pictures <laughs> and stuff and I thought that that was real cute um, and then they do have an ensuite right here. Once again, very dark aesthetics. I need to fix the bathtub right there. Um, I haven't been back into build mode, um, but they can use this toilet. I did player test that. Um, so that's how that works. Um, and I just, I know that we just saw this outdoor space, but I love it so much, so much love so much love for this outdoor space I think it is um, it's so cluttered and I think that's why I like it I uh, struggle sometimes to maximize like the actual space um, in my backyards and stuff like that and just in playing the sims I think it's kind of difficult um, can he not sleep in his actual bed you can't get to it okay apparently the table is an issue. Okay, cheats are on now. Oh, there we go. They were not on for a moment and it was problematic. Okay, but cheats are on, so that's looking good. Um, and then his bed is apparently... I think I'm gonna size this down this much um, cause it can be, it, it doesn't get in the way of the gameplay, so I'm, that's what I'm gonna do. And I know that those curtains are clipping a little bit, but I think that that might just have to happen. I don't think any of this should be, like, in his way. Surely not. Well, that should be. Hopefully that's fine. Okay, let's have him try to test it out now. Okay, it looks like he's actually going. Okay, that fixed it. It was just the table was kind of a little too close. That is something that, the one thing that with move objects that I don't actually care to do a whole bunch is to um, like move the side tables closer to the bed because um, that's a one thing that I actually have a lot of problems with. Oh, monster under the bed. Dag nabbit, I uh, did not put a light in here. I'm so bad about remembering that. Okay, well we'll just have to have Daddy-o. Come help me, Alberto. Please come in. Yes, thank you, Dad. Huh. Oh, Cohen made friends with it. Oh, look at you. I'm so proud of you. I'm really actually, I've been thinking more and more, um, just to kind of ramble for a second. I've been thinking more and more about um, the, the two uh, like kind of extra families that we have here, the like rags to riches families. And I have like, Really, really, really. Oh, 
someone wants to buy our things. Um, oh, well, get mail. But apparently we actually have to go into the inventory to actually sell that. Yeah, someone wants to buy it. Okay, um, ship. We'll just sell those paint. Oh, those were from his daughter. It's fine, she'll probably make some more. Um, let's just sell that toy. Not too worried about it. He has a bunch of stuff in his inventory. Um, ooh, we need to have him recycle again, don't we? Yeah, we do, okay. Let's have him do, what is this? Oh, Plopsy, Plopseed from successful sale on Plopsy. I was like, what is this little bunny? This cute little bunny um, emotion over here. Okay, so what I was saying is I've really always wanted so very much to run a vet clinic in The Sims 4. And so I think that that is something that I would like to do with maybe the other Rags to Riches family, um, the, the Slater fam fam. Um, yeah, that's kind of, I don't know, just something that was on my mind. Um, and I also really want to do the Strangerville, um, stuff. I kind of just want to do some stuff with y'all because I have paid to have these things more so for the build mode, um, and, like, create a sim. Things that come, I like to have the options, whether they're all color or not, I like having the options. Because the Strangerville comes with those dreads, and I really like those dreads. I think that they're quite nice. Um... But besides the point, I want to actually do the gameplay because I am actually into the show Stranger Things. Okay, sorry, my cat is um, playing again, you know. How dare she play? And it also said that he just got his first bits and pieces, and that is not true. Um, but we do need for him to... I don't know, let's have him come out here and... Does this have an inventory currently? I'm pretty sure it does. Okay guys, real life I had to pause for a second because my kid is like really biting her nail and when she does that she has moments where she just gets up and just yells. I really thought she was giving in to her nap is the whole reason I started recording and um, it's not the case. <laughs> it's not the case. Okay, so um, in the move we did acquire like an actual um, trash. I kind of was just purposely using a dumpster before. But I figured, why not? So is this good? Oh, not that. This. Yes. Okay, it's ready. Nice. Hey, Nor. Huh? Hey, but Dexo. Oh, she's hey, Fred, Bella to Foy, him. huh? Okay. Yassel. Sweet. Yuck and Narb. Put that in your inventory, and then we need for you to come and recycle some more. You know, the funny thing is that this lot is not any bigger. Um, promoted to design guru, work from home. Yes, girl, yes. Busy pomegranate juice. Okay, so she got a promotion, y'all. I think she's level five. Oh, so happy, so happy about that. That's one of the biggest reasons that I am even trying to do off-camera play. Um, where the heck is that trash? There it is. Um, I want for her to get leveled up in her job a little bit quicker so that we can just kind of maybe have some fun for a couple parts. I don't really know if I see them getting married right now. Um, I kind of think that, I mean, in the grand scheme of things, I guess them having a child now, he's off at school, like he is technically a bit, oh, love letter, um, wait and see. Sorry, like I have said it a million times, I'm so bad at actually reading those things out loud, and I don't know that I'll ever change that. I'm, I'm sorry. They're just very tedious to me. I kind of don't care for them so much. I do like when they actually 
do add like a, a new like kind of spectrum to the game. There we go, milestone complete. Achieve level five and fabrication. Um, but so often I feel like they don't add anything to the gameplay. It's just kind of the same thing and it doesn't really ever make a difference. I don't think a whole bunch. Um, cylindrical molded Campbell, C Campbell, candle. He really needs to find some dye in the dumpster. Okay, but for her, what we need to do is focus on her career. Um, what is that, level five? Yeah, okay, so she is a green technician. Oh, that's like the title, obviously, but she is a design guru, guru is her current promotion level. Um, she needs to use a fabricator and present an eco invention concept, so we need to draft up one more than likely. Let's check her inventory. Let's do that. Um, oh, she has some juice. Oh, because we just collected it. She has a ton of honey. Some stuff that she can recycle. Um, whole bunch of stuff to make stuff with. She does have, but it's eco invention concept. Okay, so she can actually present that to someone not mistaken okay she's got some stuff in her inventory um but what we what is she doing continue installing hardened grinder gears i never told her to do this to begin with hallie i'm impressed girl i am you are just killing the game over here. Um, I really tried to stay away from anything that was going to negatively impact the uh, eco footprint. I'm hoping that we get it up to a uh, green footprint sooner than later, especially because we live right here, right next to the, the beautiful stuff when it will be beautiful. It's not currently. I don't know what he's doing. You're not dipping a candle. You're just, are you just talking? Like the fake waterfall, the, the city, the water stuff. Are you dipping a candle or are you just looking at it? Like, what are you doing, bud? Um, I wanted her to do some stuff, but oh, declining health, declining health. Nurture, oh gosh, nurture, nurture. Um, and then I will probably check back in with that situation that she was just uh, installing better stuff. So proud of you. But she needs to not kill the, the grubs and stuff. That's what she needs to do. <laughs> what else does he have to do for his? Uh, fabricate five times and have five dies. Okay. So he needs to do some diving and some fabricating. And that's what I would love to just do that and not have to focus so much on her career. So I really want for her to just master out this career, you know? You know, guys? I put this fake grass everywhere um, that has the eco footprint like booster. So we really should be like doing pretty good sooner than later i would imagine um he finished making his candle oh wait i won't where is he going okay but i'll i'll let you do that but i, w I wanted to talk to you oh did he did he have to go to the restroom oh no he's eating cake He just ran inside so he could eat cake. I don't even blame you. I, I don't even blame you. I'm, oh. I'm honestly, I'm kind of proud. Kind of proud to call you mine. Oh. <laughs> that is hilarious. Um, still declining. Oh, and now they're hungry. Great. Just want for her to finish the nurturing really quick and hopefully they won't die in the meantime. I don't know, maybe we shouldn't nurture those just yet. Feed them really quick. Feed them. 
Um, I don't know. We, let's let them eat really quick and sell the money fruits. Sell, sell all the money fruits. Make that money, girlfriend. And then, um, I guess harvest everything. We really don't need it. I, I feel like we kind of have everything that we need when it comes to that, but it's okay. I'm, I'm down. And then she can load up some ingredients. You see, juicing is not uh, like her primary focus right now, but um, do it. Yeah, I guess we can just purchase dyes. Is that cheaty? Does it matter? We have a money tree. I can afford them. I'm gonna wait. Let's see. Let's put in some real effort to find some dyes, and uh, we'll, we'll be good. You know, we'll try it that way. Okay, so when you're done with that and you've done put your stuff in in the in the juicer, we I guess we don't have to bug him just yet. I want to I want to queue it up though. Oh, she's already on her way to to do the juicing. Okay, I'll be patient. <laughs> I thought about just doing it, but apparently that is not a good idea. Um we have been kind of juicing with the same stuff. Let's make some rose juice or or whatever that that makes. Ah. I don't know what that makes. Start fizzing. It costs 68 bucks, whatever uh -huh. it does. Okay, Ellie or oh my gosh, I do that every time. Alberto, are you you still in the bathroom? Okay, can we talk to you real quick? I really would like to present a, this concept to you. Yorba! <laughs> Yumo! What do you mean? He's right here. Come talk to him. Yeah. Get on it. Oh. <laughs> um, we'll just put this in the trash for them. Good job presenting her her yeah, thing over man. here. So Barbara, a we just use Elliot for yeah, stuff like this. Or a bar? In Nemo, a plea. What's a bow as far as? Yet a veil. Cohen is back Put from school. Two? No need to make room on America. the refrigerator oh, door. Ugh. <laughs> oh. Okay. Don't have that be. Um, I think that she just needs to use the that. fabricator now. Oh. And that's another thing is whenever we moved, I thought that I fabricated um, a rug for Cohen's room, a yellow rug, and it was not in the inventory at all. So I don't know if it was like unsuccessful. I don't know what the issue is. Um, is he out here talking to Tina Tinker for? Tina, what you want? Is he friends with Tina? I don't know. Come and ask her about her day. <laughs> sure. I suppose that we can be nice to Tina. Oh, come on, buddy. Actually go get some sleep, you know, get in bed. Okay, so she's over here trying to do her thing, trying to get her life together. Is voting open? No, it's closed. It is open again on Friday. Okay. Okay. Well, thanks for asking, Knox. Our day has been good. He says that he's pretty much done with what he wanted to do, but wants to know if he can hang out. He only came over here for our recycling machine. Um, but <laughs> thanks for asking how we're doing. I appreciate that. Tina's like, I should really get going. Yes, Alberto, get it. Dancing machine over here. Achieve level five in fabrication. Hmm. Um, empty trash, do that. I'm gonna make him dig through the dumpster, I think. 
even though he is really not a big fan of that. Okay, here he comes. Here he comes with the trash. Good job, buddy. Look at you. All right, dive for those deals. Do it. Dive for all the deals. All right, what's she doing? Oh, she's still doing this? Come on. Is it gonna work? I'm trying to do the uh, hydroponic planter so that maybe some of our stuff we don't have to worry so much about. Oh, yay, okay, it worked. Um, about, you know, watering all the time. Um, she does need to get her logic skill up, so I think what we're gonna make her do, she can grab a bite to eat really quick. Uh, I don't clean out spoiled food and then grab leftovers and then uh, and then you can come over here and get your logic skill up my girl keep diving for those deals buddy what's up Nox what can we do for you oh he doesn't even know Nox let's get some points from that what do you like just not introduce yourself to Nox how is that even a thing Okay, he found some recycled materials, introduced himself to Nox. He's not even feeling that uncomfortable just yet. All right. Yes. Oh, she even came outside to eat. See, this is what I'm talking about. This is the dream right here. Let's get a close up here. I think Hallie is so cute. I love her like edgy, oh, edginess to her. Uh -huh. I think she's so cute. Wait, where are you going? Oh, I paused it, didn't mean to. Oh, she's gonna go play chess now. Okay, well that's fine. I'm down for that. She is seriously the cutest. I love her. Okay, well, we'll let her get that skill up a bit. What's he got over here? Um, let's see if he has any dye in his inventory. That is the real question. Did you find any dye? He did not find any flippin' dye. Okay. I think that I'm just gonna start selling the candles from the inventory. I can't list it on, oh, I can. Okay, sweet, we'll do that. Cause I really don't um, wanna put them at the table. I think that people have a bad habit of buying them because they're cheaper than my juice. And I want you to just buy my juice. Thank you. <laughs> um, yeah. Let's see, let's have him come out here and stock the table, tend the table, do a little yard sale, and um, then we'll have her just, I don't know, you know, keep working on her life. Where's that logic skill at? Tina, you are more than welcome to come over, maybe buy some juice while you're here. Who's calling her now? No one? Okay, good. Oh, someone. Ten table. I just... This is why I wish. No, no. Wondering if I, I would like to go over to her house. Ooh. Is it because I kicked you off your lot and I'm now living on your lot? And so you want to show me the terrible state that you're living in? Nope. Sorry, we're busy. We're going to hang out with Tina Tinker. Okay, let's have him start up a yard sale. Um, oh, she's still working pretty hard here, huh? Where's that skill at, girl? Oh, we're only 45% complete. Okay, she's got to keep working on that. <laughs> oh, you again. You know what? You either be nice and you, like, buy something nicely or you just get out of here because you were mean last time. 
you you Hold started fights with everyone. Levis. It was not very nice. We're not a fan. Uh, Nilshaba. Chul. Okay, is he Buena, Buen. talking Buen. to him? Yeah, don't chat with him. Buy some of my stuff or get lost. You came over here and you started a bunch of fights last time. I get that we have the rough helping encouraged right now, but that does not mean that you are in the right. Blown of Pogum. Amoeba. Flicks. Stop chatting with him. Ten? I swear. Now he's just dancing. Okay, somebody come and buy something, please. We have been having this yard sale for forever and no one is buying anything. Is this best? Oh no. It's a, a nap inspector? Yeah. <laughs> what you want? No one is coming to buy anything. Well, this is very disappointing. Nobody cares about our juice. Nobody cares at all. Okay, well, um... Stop tending the table. Maybe we can have her come and tend the table. I don't know if it makes a difference. But this is bumming me out. <laughs> um, I was gonna have him work on his homework. But it looks like he's kind of got some stuff he needs to take care of. Naturally. Who is out here? What? What are you doing? Oh, someone wants to buy something. He's like, man, I'm just trying to cook. Um, but thanks. Alright, you can ship that out on Flopsy. We'll sell this for about salvage part. All of my Sims have a future cube right now. Anyone else dealing with that? Is that just a thing? They're trying to give us hints on the future cubes? Um, I think that someone's actually come and bought some stuff. Oh, there's a fight in our bedroom between Tina and probably the vampire, if I had to guess. Dang it, let's just replace this because I don't feel like, oh, that's not the vampire. I expected the vampire. Who is this? Rylan? Rylan? Okay. Not who I was expecting, but we'll take it. So, Alright, stop tending the table. I don't think anyone's going to come buy anything. You can just clear the table. <laughs> Goodness me. Who are you? You were just in my master bedroom, like just literally right there, fighting. What What do you mean? Ah. Alberto, say hi to this dude. See what he wants. Excuse me. What 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 can we do for you? What would you like? Sona. <laughs> if you what didn't up? already get enough from us. Uh, All right. Well, that was ready. What do we have here? The fruit, oh, the fruit, the juice is ready. Scrap whoever's painting that is supposed to be Tina, probably. She's out here making a candle on our, our candle making station. Who told you that you could do such a thing? Floral Rose Kombucha. Yeah, we'll just keep it that. And then load some more ingredients, my dearest. I feel like we've gotten a lot done in this part. She got a promotion. Um, no, no apples. We have, I think, more of these things now. Um, do a, the Museberry. Ah, a 
flush. <laughs> Load that and then start fizzing whatever seltzer that's gonna make. And then practice some yoga because we don't ever let you just like do anything, you know? You're always out here just having the hardest time with your life and I think that you deserve it, girl. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else that I wanted to do in this part and I kind of think that, oh, it's her stupid birthday. Touche, touche. Um, let's open up this fridge and see if we have a cake. I doubt we do. I think that I, yeah, I let them eat that cake. Okay, um, does he have the aspirational points to get a sleep replacement? Oh, that's select new aspiration. That's not what I wanted. Um, I think that he does, though. Sleep replacement is 400, yes. Okay, we're gonna have him take that so that he's feeling a bit more energized. And then we're going to have him bake her a cake. And we will age her up and then we will be done with this part probably for today. Um, let's go down here towards the, ooh, coconut cake. Yeah, bake her up a coconut cake. That sounds good. That sounds real good. This, uh, Rylan, this Rylan dude is really just getting it and having a great time. And I, I feel you, dude. I'm happy for you. Um, did you introduce yourself to, to this person? Um, ask him about his day, maybe, because he's a social butterfly kind of sim. And we will definitely be playing with Cohen in the future. It's kind of what I was getting at um, in the, the beginning of this part when I was talking about um, having the extra, like, Slater fam. Oh, excuse you. Why are, are you being rude to our child? I will send you home. Um, but the Slater fam and, uh, I guess, the Feldman wing fam. It's Hallie is the founder of this save file for sure, and her last name is Feldman. Um, but anyways, <laughs> if they decide to get married, um, it would probably be in the next season because we're probably only going to play a few more parts of this out. Um, maybe not even a few. We'll, we'll have to see. I will kind of update you guys in the next part. Witness to a bully, um, always step in and stand up for your friend. Always. That's how I feel. Um, all right, let's have her stop with the yoga. Let's have him put candles on it. And I'm gonna double check this, but I'm barely certain I got the notification. Um, yes, today is her birthday. Today is her stupid birthday. <laughs> Can't believe she's an adult already. At least she's out here. She's got a beautiful family, a beautiful home. You know, she might have stolen another woman's man, but that was his decision. Like, he was actively hitting on our girl. Is he being mean? I swear, if you're mean to our kid, I will come after you 100%. <laughs> All right, Hallie, you're an adult. I can't believe it. Hallie aged up. Adulthood. Start planning for retirement. All right, well, you look the exact same. Flawless. Love it. Um, take a piece of your cake, and uh, we're going to unstuck your kid here. His arm's out. He, he got stuck. All right, guys, well, I think that that is it for this part. Um, just trying to make sure everyone just grabs a bite of cake and, and kind of enjoys themselves. But um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. If you have anything that you would like to see this family do in the future, um, or I will just kind of come up with it, or we'll see what the next game pack is that's supposed to be coming out this fall. I'm really excited for more details about that. I, 
I'm hoping that we get details soon. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for stopping by. Stay safe out there, and I will catch y'all later. Bye!